Yogananda Wisdom Story, The Magic Carrot. In ancient days, there lived in India a woman with a very quarrelsome disposition. She was named Kalaha, which means quarrel in Bengali. Miss Kalaha started word battles with anyone at the slightest pretext, and she could brook no performance of any good action. Time went by, and Kalaha grew in evil disposition and wicked deeds. At last, the angel of death cast her out of her body. Then her astral body began to descend the spiral stairway of gloom down into the deepest region of Stygian darkness. She landed with a thud on the vapor-spitting floor of Hades. In agony and fright, she shouted for mercy as she saw the angel of death leaving her in that dismal place where sinful shadows live in torture and despair. Somehow attracted by the plaintive, intense noise of the wicked woman, Yama, the angel of death, returned and accosted her. Please, can't you remember any good action you performed during your earthly sojourn, so that I might parole you from this awful place you've landed due to your self-created errors? The wicked woman scratched her head for a while, and after a long inner search she cried out, Oh yes, your majesty, I do remember one kind act of mine. Once I had a bunch of carrots. I was about to eat them all when I found that one of them contained a worm, so I gave that wormy carrot to another person on the condition that he eat only the good part and throw away the rest without killing the worm. That will do, replied Yama. He waved his hand, and that carrot came floating through the air toward the sin-filled woman. Yama continued, Wicked woman, grasp this carrot and hang on to it. Don't let loose your hold, and you will reach heaven. The woman greedily seized the carrot and started ascending heavenward. Seeing this, another sinner took hold of her leg, and a second sinner held the leg of the first, and a third hung on to the legs of the second, and so on until a chain of one hundred sinners became suspended from the feet of the wicked woman. The magic carrot with the wicked woman and the chain of one hundred sinners began to race toward heaven like a zooming rocket. The wicked woman was overjoyed to find herself so easily freed from the hands of after-death justice. When she felt a tug at her feet, she looked down and realized that the chain of sinners was going heavenward with her. This aroused her anger since she couldn't bear the thought of anyone else winning the favor of the angel of death. In rage, she shouted, You undeserving sinners, let go of my feet. How dare you soar toward heaven with my charmed carrot? The other sinners no sooner released their hold upon her feet than she plunged down through space and dropped with a thud upon the same floor of Hades. Meanwhile, because of their faith, even in an exalted sinner, the sinners were given the carrot, and the chain of sinners raced up until they reached the gates of heaven. Wisdom Gem from Paramhansa Yogananda Even a small act of goodness may be a tiny raft of salvation across the treacherous gulf of sin. But one who drinks the wine of selfishness and dances on the little boat of meanness sinks in the ocean of ignorance. Selfish happiness, which cannot bear to witness the well-being of others, is bound to come to grief.